Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the channel once again. Welcome to the delayed flight. We are departing from Kiev, and everything uh, seems to be extremely unpleasant. The weather, I mean. So let's get started quickly without any further explanation. We have a 777-200 this time. Actually, we performed the aerobatics also with the 777-200. We don't have any facilities, I'm afraid. And I don't think there is any reason to ask for power supply because we don't have any in the airport. So, okay, let us hope that our engines will start running. Engine number one, engine number two, good. Let us turn on our lights. I arranged also the internal lights a little bit so we are ready to depart the funny thing is that i was having this new add-on kiev city i mean expecting to have a last look but somehow unfortunately this was not meant to be because the weather is so bad have your preferred weather this real weather somehow it is a how to say it is a kind of drag and doesn't help a lot because at this time I have real weather. I don't know what I will do during the landing. I really don't know because this is quite unpleasant, isn't it? And maybe above the clouds we will feel slightly better. Maybe. Meanwhile, we st we are still trying to go to the runway, which is 26, if I remember well, and to depart from here. And I only hope that above the clouds weather will be slightly better, I mean. Maximum flaps, 30, because uh, I don't know about the runway. The runway is a short runway, about seven something or 8,000 feet. Yeah, also rain. Air India triple seven two hundred. It is about three o'clock, three o'clock at noon right now here. Yeah, I think it is more safe. And let us live anyhow, let us live. Uh, I don't want to make my life even more difficult. Uh, we will not uh, use toga mode. I have already set an altitude of uh, 6,000 feet and uh, vertical speed of about 2,000, 1.9,000 feet per minute. And also the visibility is extremely bad. I have set already a drone camera and this is how it looks like. Okay, what to say? Maybe if I go a little bit closer to the runway, I don't know if the, uh, I have the correct uh, point here because... Uh, okay, we don't see nothing at all. So let us leave and uh, let us hope that we will manage to leave from this airport flaps maximum set engines 95 percent i don't think it is wise to have engines 100 percent okay we are departing and we don't see nothing at all with a drone camera 80 
130 is not enough. 140. Okay, good, good. Gear up. We are airborne finally. And I engage the autopilot. Yeah, we don't see nothing anymore. And also the throttle is on. Unfortunately, we will not see Kiev for a last time because the weather is bad. And by the way, I didn't change the speed. I changed the altitude, seems by mistake. So 240. Okay, 235. Flaps fully retracted. Okay, hands free. And we go west, so it is okay. We go west. We go west. That is why we chose uh, 26, runway 26. Okay, an altitude of 6,000. I think everything is just fine, and we go. Breslau or Wroclaw, something like this, in Poland, monitoring at the same time our instruments. So, uh, UKKK is Giuliani Airport. And EPWR is our destination good and is there any approach I'm I don't expect much I really don't there is an ILS I don't even have the ILS frequency anyhow ILS 29 no I don't want transition so execute Okay, uh, we change to navigation mode now. Lateral navigation, okay. Good. And let us continue climbing at 10,000 feet. I wonder if we will see the sun finally. CTRL page up. 13,000 feet with a vertical speed of 2,000 steeper okay so once again we are hands free let us change the range and let us increase our speed also CTRL shift and insert have a look here CTRL shift and insert here indicated airspeed to 300. When you are turning, it is good uh, not to have a very high speed because you cannot turn actually. Let us go to 300 anyhow because we are on course as I saw. Yeah, everything is just fine. Good, good, good. Okay, we are leaving and we are heading to the west. However, visibility again is not the best, so I will change the altitude to 20,000. Let us see. Clouds cannot stay forever. 20,000. You know that usually I don't fly that high, but what to say, this is quite depressive at the moment, yes. No, we only have the approach as far as I can see. Mm. Okay, we don't have all the waypoints. It is so depressive right now that I will be more social. I didn't see Kiev for a last time. Okay. 
Kiev Center, Air India, Niner 6 Tree Niner, is type Boeing 10 miles west of Uniform Kilo Victor, November 12,900 feet. Request clearance to transition Charlie airspace. Air India, Niner 6 Tree, Niner Kiev Center. Something is wrong with my... Something is wrong with my stupid altitude. Why? Stabilize that... Uh, I will make it 2.3. It was stabilized at 13,000 feet. I have set here 19. Did you copy? Yes, I did. Squawk 6502, Air India, Niner 639er. We are climbing to 20,000 feet and nothing changed at all. I mean, this is what to say. I don't like much. I'm still waiting to get above the clouds. This is what I'm expecting. Nothing changed. 19,000 feet, 29,000 feet. I don't know. 25, okay. 25,000 feet. Let us continue climbing. And I will increase also my speed close to maximum speed of 325, 330 maybe. I think this is the most depressive flight so far. Okay. This is quite dark. Now the only thing we are waiting for is to get above the clouds somehow. I don't know. Thirty thousand feet. It, it is much more easy just to press one button to to deactivate real weather, isn't it? And just to have some nice flight. Don't use uh, real weather real time always. I'm quite stuck with this and. Uh, I wouldn't uh, suggest you to do so. I will go to space until I will see uh, better weather. I will go until space, I, I will go until stratosphere. Instead of Breslau, maybe we will go, maybe we will go to the moon, okay. Yes, I don't want it all. And let us change quickly the frequency. Okay. Shall I continue to 38? Maybe it is slightly better. For those who followed the previous clips, the cockpit of the 767-300 that we showed lately, it is quite impressive. I mean, this is a little bit dull, but anyhow, we stabilized at uh, 37. If 
thousand feet as it seems. About the ceiling, I checked it out. It is forty-three thousand feet, so we may as well climb a little bit higher to forty thousand. I have never done such things. I don't climb that high. Forty-one thousand, okay. Yes, I don't climb that high, never. So I will leave the cockpit. Let us go inside the cabin. Yes. Now, the reason we chose the 777-200 is because the airport is bad. We go to Breslau, Poland, or Wroclaw, and uh, the airport, I didn't like the, the runway, I had the look. Actually, it is a short runway, and that is why we took the 777-200. And uh, also, it is a narrow runway. I saw here that there is an eyeless frequency. I don't even know the eyeless frequency and let us hope it will appear. This we can see right now. No, we don't have the eyeless frequency. Huh. We don't have the eyeless frequency and I didn't check it out. I wonder what can I do about it. And I will search the eyeless frequency in Google if I can find. Okay, we stabilized more or less. So let us go out. Of course, always we must monitor the instruments, isn't it? Okay. And we go back to our cockpit. Now, for instance, if you have a look here, you will see that the frequency will change. Useless information of the day. Here. Have a look at the squawk here, 6502. Here, 4404, you see, okay. Radar contact. Now, the reason we chose uh, Vroslo Airport is because uh, somehow it was the only, let's see. Okay, the airport is nothing special, but at least it is a bespoke airport in Warsaw. I didn't find something. This is the reason we chose Breslau. This is why. Okay, I remodified my cameras. And so from the right side, now we have these three. Old 5, Old 7. And mostly this one, Alt 9, which is a brand new one. And from the other side of the plane, Alt 4. From the left side, Alt 6 and Alt 8. Now about the eyeless frequency, I had a look at Google and uh, I see something uh, 110.3. But uh, the only problem is that I saw another runway. I mean, it is not 29, but 30. Now, how can this be? I don't know, and I don't trust. But anyhow, it is better than nothing. I don't rely on ILS frequencies in general. So we will descend to 20,000 feet. Yes, hopefully weather is much more better. Yes, this is good news, definitely. And from the right side, old 5, 7, the magnificent 7 and old 9. Yeah, good, good, good. Can I put some music, something, because uh, what to say? This is a little bit boring. Okay, okay, okay.
Okay, why not? The second of uh, Sostakovich, the second walls. Airport in uh, Warsaw is uh, Chopin Airport, isn't it? First class. So once again speed brakes. Okay. Uh, here on the VFR map I don't see any ILS frequency. Here I don't see something written. And also we have an elevation of 400 feet. Let us not forget this one. Indeed runway is 29. About 8 or 3000 feet long. But hopefully weather is a little bit better, so let us hope that everything will be just fine. Now I don't like the weather once again, but uh, anyhow. Strachowice. Strachowice, Warslav. Warslav, Breslau. Warslav. Airport. This is where we go and let us descend to 8,000. Ah, okay, 400 elevation, 8.4. Everything will be cal calculated plus 400 feet. Okay, because we have the elevation of 400 feet on the runway. So 8.4 is actually 8,000 feet from the ground. Oh no. I mean, it is useless to see if we will have uh, ILS frequency. It seems we don't have any. But anyhow, we'll have a look later here. 
Okay. Who cares? Good weather is not that bad as I was expecting. This is good news. Yes, it seems to be just fine. Let us not forget the elevation. Oh no, oh no. <sighs> okay. Winds is something but 37. But anyhow, it seems to be tailwind, isn't it? So we descend to six to four thousand feet. There is no ILS frequency. I don't see any glide slope or localizer. I can as well land from the other side, runway eleven. Okay. Let us continue descending. I don't like, I don't like, and why should I? Yes, we are, we are quite high. Shall I ask permission? Bromsloft Tower, Air India, Niner 6 Tree Niner, is 21 miles southeast, 7,000 feet, with whiskey to land. And I cannot ask for another runway, if this is so important. Ah, see, local, ah, uh, see, ah, uh, ILS appeared. Can we descend quickly? I think not. N I think not. Anyhow. Make straight in runway 29er Air India 9er 639er. ILS appeared. That was a major surprise. 13 miles. I mean, I'm no, no, I think we cannot. If I turn to approach immediately, disengage the auto throttle ten miles. Runway, two niner, Air India, niner, okay, disengage the autopilot. Let us go for it. Runway twenty nine. Sixty-six. I don't see the runway. Oh no. Okay, it is a missed approach. Okay. It is a missed approach. It is a missed approach. Okay. Yes, now it will be eleven. This is the guidance of the ILS. That was the guidance of the ILS. Okay, now it will be eleven. I think we will have a better luck now. Collapse. Mm. 
Okay. So we go to land. From the other side of the runway. Okay. I cannot ask permission, unfortunately. I could. Yeah, I cannot. I can only ask. Airport Tower Arindia, direction. Niner six three niner okay. is unfamiliar with the area. Request directions to the airport. So let us go for it. Arindia Niner six three niner airport is eleven o'clock seven miles. At least we are lined up on time this time. 400 feet elevation, let us not forget this one. Speed brakes. Speed brakes retracted. Okay. Again, speed brakes. Speed brakes retracted again. Okay. Six hundred. I think I will manage, okay, I'm not afraid. Yes, I'm not afraid. Arindia Niner, 639 exit runway when able. Ah, she didn't say you are not clear to land. And I think it was not a terrible. Okay, we reached Braslo. Strachowice which is Nikolaus Copernicus Airport, I think. Arindia Niner, 639 contact ground on yeah, 120.255. Good. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Poland, welcome to Breslau, welcome to Wroclaw Airport, Nikolaus Copernicus Airport, close to Strachowice. Good, good, okay, excellent. Uh, so we can stop recording and have One a look at our landing decimal. i checked it out it is not that bad this plane didn't exist uh, when we landed and i don't know why he's standing in the middle of the runway i mean i really don't know because this can be something very terrible i really don't know why uh but anyhow uh 145 something, 145 something, and we bounced once again 145 per minute. I don't know why he's standing in the middle of the runway. I mean, I really don't know. Okay, this too. Why is he standing in the middle of the runway? I mean, this is not this is not polite, actually, isn't it? Let us see these two cameras. Yeah, this is not polite. I mean, this is really not polite. What are you doing here, man? Ah, 
uh, lately we suffer from uh, the dreadful floating. Yeah, this is not polite, I mean. Okay. You see, here is the dreadful floating. But anyhow, it is something about 150, and second time about 120. And my baby Air India, 777-200, she landed just fine, I mean. Yes, she did. Exactly. Yeah, threat with floating. Huh, unbelievable. Okay, 180 even maybe. And the second is much more better. Okay, good. Good, good. So ladies and gentlemen, I will not insist much, maybe I will just uh, record uh, the landing. We don't say yet, thank you for watching this clip. Maybe I will record again the landing with some music. And uh, this will be all, I think, and we will continue to this airport, because it is a bespoke airport, as I said. So, until soon, and not until next time, because we will continue with the landing.